My name is Mohamed Safat and I'm from Egypt. My name is Tassiane, I'm from Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. Uh, my name is András, I'm from Slovenia and uh, currently I am uh, a student at BIMA A+, but I'm also employed uh, at IBE, which is one of the uh, associate partners at BMA Plus. Well, as a structural engineer and by dealing with modeling and the structure models and workflow from architectural conceptual design to the construction phase, I figure out that the future of construction industry lies in building information modeling, BIM. It does not become an option right now. It's become mandatory to learn this technology to can have a position in, the arch uh, in, in, the, in this in the industry. So I choose to deepen my knowledge in BIM because in Brazil it's a real necessity from 2021 on. It's going to be mandatory for public projects. So I felt that it was time for me to, to get more professional than I was already with the tools. Uh, I enrolled in this master um, because I wanted to become a BIM uh, manager in power sector some sometime uh, in the near future and hopefully uh, make a difference. It, uh, it is an ideal master program because it has been designed to combine theoretical knowledge and practical side. And professionally speaking, uh, will qualify me to continue my studies as a PhD in, building te in BIM technology. And in BIMA Plus I found the um, an entire program that would benefit me as a professional and mind the, the national mar market. And also because it, BIM is really been highly used in the entire world. So I think that could all, also open a lot of doors professionally for me. I was uh, informed about, the, uh, about this master by one of the uh, professors. Uh, so I, I saw a great opportunity. I, I um, went through obviously the program and spoke to, to your uh, um, students from the last year and I was convinced. It will be spectacular. And uh, why? Because I found uh, it really worth every single moment you spent here in the program and I experienced and tested more than I expected. I would say it's challenging because that's the word. I mean, we are um, fa we are faced every day with all these new tools and all really important and really, really useful. Is planned. I think that the program is really well planned and that everyone is really well prepared with the material, the time schedule, etc. Uh, it was a bit intense and that was expected. Uh, for me, I do like the atmosphere of cooperation and, and the study uh, and the study here with the staff and the colleague, even or despite the COVID uh, COVID nineteen restrictions. For us to be actually um, working towards the beam and everything it stands for. So the first few months were really intense, uh, but balanced between the all the material that we have in within the master program and the activities that we are supposed to, to develop to actually assimilate all the information that we are receiving every day. <laughs> I think we learned a lot and we um, met a lot of uh, great uh, individuals from the industry and also saw uh, what were the problems they were facing, which were, by the way, the same problems that we are facing in, in our company because probably everyone is facing them and also how they are solving them. So maybe we saw something, something new, we learned something new from the actual experience from the industry. Take a deep look at the program website and you will get the courage to apply. Uh, it is only one year and I'm pretty sure that it will shortly cut more than one step through your career path development. All the topics are really related to what I was looking for while in Brazil, so that's why I, I decided to apply and thankfully I, I got it. <laughs> uh, if you're a beginner, I think this is a perfect program for you to learn a lot and a lot more than your peers know right now. And if you're already experienced, I think 
you will find out that you still have a lot of a lot of things new things to learn and this is a perfect program to do it uh, i'm kind of person who focus on body language and eye contact during talks and but since we are uh, wearing this mask it's a bit hard for me but uh, we become adapted to this right now i had to develop myself to be actual actual in classes and paying attention with everything that was going around everybody and we were uh, really worried about everybody so uh, covid was a unfortunate thing but it was also the chance for us to develop something for ourselves the program did really well by managing covid and i don't think that we had to compromise what we learned and what was our experience I believe, not only expect, that it will be a gate to continue in developing my career path. And after the second semester, specifically, uh, I mean the thesis work, it will be done by cooperation with the program or the master program uh, partners that will qualify me to can find a good opportunity in the field of work. After the master, I expect to be uh the kind of professional that is needed in the market to make the ANC sector better and with all the good um, consequences that BIM can bring us. For now, my path is uh, quite defined. I'll get back to my company and to work at IBE, uh, which is my also my sponsor at this uh, program. So it's. Uh, makes sense. I plan on becoming a BIM manager in power sector and uh, make a difference in how um, BIM is used in large-scale uh, infrastructure projects and uh, uh, all kinds of project, projects in power sector.